What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Amir Views here. We back with another video, man. We back with another banger. We back to open the mind. Y'all already know what time it is, man. The grind don't stop. Uh, I just recorded a whole vlog. Y'all gonna, gonna be seeing that after. Y'all gonna be seeing this Tuesday. And now I'm recording another video. Just eight. Grind don't stop, bro. Grind don't stop. I'm staying consistent, bro, because if I don't get where I want to go and I'm consistent, I can take that and just quit. Anyways. Today, we're talking about social media and the bad effects social media have, especially on our men, bro. I'm, I'm going to talk to my guys specifically. Normally, I talk to everybody, but today I'm talking to my guys, bro. We have a problem in the community. We have a problem in the male community, the young man community. I'll be on Twitter, right? I'll be on Twitter and I'll be, you know, I'll be, I'm in communities with like, just like dudes and we be talking about like, you know, they just be talking about random stuff or like sending pictures of them talking to females and stuff. Dog, I'll be seeing... I be seeing dudes just be sending money to girls. <clears throat> Mind you, they're not their girlfriend. They just be sending money to girls. They be like, I saw this one, I saw this one post. If I can find it, I will put it in a video. I'm getting my editing. I'm getting my editing skills up. So I'm gonna start st sticking to my word. If I can find it, I'm gonna put it in a video. There was this dude. There was a there was a girl that posted it. And no, 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 it was a dude that posted it. And she was like, oh, you treat me so good. Um, I get my nails done, my hair done, my toes. This, that. Basically, he's paying for everything, right? He's paying for all her, her all her essentials, her nails, her toes, all this, her hair. She like, she like, um, I, either she said, I'm not going back to my ex or like my ex would never or something like that. And then she said something she was going to do to him sexually. And then a the dude had quote tweeted that and was like, We're, this is base, this is not prostitution. And honestly, it is, bro, because what are we doing, bro? This is basically paying for the woman, bro. Like, there, there's no way he he genuinely wants to do that. It's not his girlfriend. It was just a random girl he was talking to. And that can cost, bro. Y'all know y'all know women's stuff is, is expensive. Hair can be like 200. Nails going to be like 60, 50, 80, sometimes 100. Like, and y'all just throwing y'all money away. Y'all work, y'all work hard for y'all money. Y'all just throwing it away, bro. Like, can we not do this? Like, because I don't want the next generation. I don't want my son and his friends and my nephews to be going around thinking they got to pay a woman to be with them. They got to pay a woman for them to like them. And it's not even on some red pill stuff. I'm just talking from experience. You don't have to pay money to hang out with a girl. If a girl wants, if a girl likes you if a girl messes with you she will link with you anywhere bro she will link with you on a trail she will link with you buying a grocery store she will find any way to see you if she can see you she's there that's if she genuinely likes you but the thing about y'all bro y'all are not likable bro they just like what's in y'all pockets and i'm not here to i'm not here to bash women if i was a girl shoot and i do want to pay for all my stuff why wouldn't i turn that down because y'all dudes are so dumb bro like think about this bro the main reason y'all feel like y'all have to pay for these women, the main reason y'all feel like y'all have to pay for these women, like, for everything, this is that and a third, and I'm not even talking about your wife or your girl, because that's different, because as a man, as a young man or a man, you're supposed to be a provider, you know what I'm saying, protector and provider, those are our two roles, right, so I'm not talking about that, I'm talking about random chicks, just, you, you single, you got a roster of chicks, two, three of them, and, like, you feel like you have to pay for everything, because, oh my god, what if this other dude's paying, don't worry about none of that, bro, listen, what I was about to say is the reason y'all feel like y'all have to pay for these women is because y'all are boring at heart, bro. And why are y'all boring? Because y'all don't know yourselves, bro. Y'all don't know how to have a conversation with a woman. Y'all don't know how to have deep conversations with a woman. Y'all don't know how to y'all don't know how to have a woman open up to you. Y'all don't know what that feels like. So what do y'all do when y'all get into some money? When y'all start making some good bread, what y'all think? I wasn't getting no hoes then, so now I got the bread. Now the hoes gonna come. No, bro. No, bro. Yes. Does having money help when you're talking to women? Of course it does. Having money helps with everything in life, but it's not a necessity that you need. Now, if you want to start a family, yeah, you need bread. You don't need to, You shouldn't be broke. I'm not saying that. But what I'm saying is y'all be trying to live this lifestyle that I don't have to live, bro. And honestly, the woman will respect you more if you don't even live that type of lifestyle. Of course, they're accepting it because, again, like I said, why wouldn't they? If, if it was a, if it was reversed and girls was trying to trick us out, why wouldn't we accept it? Right. I mean, the reality, some girls do some girls pay for your haircut. Some girls, you know, what I'm saying buy your video games or whatever, because they really rock with you. They're not doing it for them, for, for you to like them. You know what I'm saying? If you guys get what I'm saying, hopefully I get what I'm saying. What I'm saying is y'all make money 
and materialistic things, y'all personality. Can we like, I'll literally be on Twitter. Just, I'll be mind blown. Like the, some of the things y'all be texting women, some of the things y'all be doing for women. And it's like, what are we doing, bro? There's no more men of integrity. There's no more men with morals. There's no, no more men with backbone. Oh my God. Backbone is a key, bro. Back. Y'all don't have no more backbone, bro. Y'all don't know how to say no to women. Y'all don't know how to say no for yourself. You don't know how to stand up for yourself. And when you don't know yourself, of course, of course, you're going to when you get a pretty girl, when you get a pretty woman, you're going to let her walk all over you because you're like, oh, it's the baddest girl I'll ever have. I don't want to lose her. I don't want to be lonely. There's so many videos that tie into this video. So I'm going to leave them in the, in, the, in the video. The loneliness It's so many videos, bro. But more of the story, bro. Can we can we not normalize tricking? Like, if that's what you want to do, if you want to learn the hard way, I guess. I've never tricked on a girl, bro. Um, I'm only 18 years old, but, like, I've never, like, felt like I need to pay for a girl thing. If you my girl, I'm going to go all out because you my girl. We exclusive. But if it was a random chick I'm talking to, I don't like when bees pull up on me like that. If it's a random chick I'm talking to, I'm not doing that, bro. Like, we going to, we going to parks because I like nature. I'm not even trying to be on some cheap stuff. I just like nature. I like what I like. I want to bring you into my world. If you like museums, we'll go to a museum. You feel me? But it, it's honestly ridiculous what y'all be doing, bro. Like, I literally be on Twitter like, bro, what is going on? If I, again, if I could find some of these tweets, I will show y'all, bro. Like, and then y'all be weirdos, bro. Like, y'all don't know how to talk to women. The key to, the, the, the key, if you really just, if you just want to sleep with a girl, right? Get in her mind. Because they're more mental than us. You know what I'm saying? I mean, we are too, but I'm saying like, if you can get her mind going, you're good, bro. If you can make a connection with the girl, even if you just got one and go, even if y'all agree, listen, we don't, we're not going to be in no relationship. We're just going to be hanging around, doing whatever. You can still have a connection with the girl because there's dudes that do that and just take her shopping. Like, I literally see dudes, first DMs be like, oh, you so pretty. Let me take you shopping. What, what are we doing, bro? What are we doing as a man, as a male community? What are we doing, yo? You're going to take a girl shopping. You have no idea who she is, how her personality is. You just see her on Instagram highlights. She look bad. She got a fat ass. And you see that and you think, oh, she, I'm going to take her shopping. Or I'm going to take her to the, the most fanciest restaurant in my city. <laughs> you don't know. You don't know how she is a person. You don't know how she treats people. You don't know if she's messed up in the head. You don't know any of this, but you just see the beauty. You just see the body. And you want to start tricking. And it's mainly for the dudes that was broke and didn't get didn't get no females. And now that they get females, now they feel like the money is gonna attract females. They think because they was broke, they wasn't getting no females. No, you wasn't getting no females because you was a lame, bro. You are a lame. You still a lame. Once a lame, always a lame. Money just amplifies who you are. It don't make you. Money don't make who you are. It just it just amplifies who you are. If you're a lame. If you're naturally just a loser, if you're naturally just a pushover, if you don't have no backbone and you start making some good money, you're going to be a lame, a loser, a dude with no backbone with a thousand dollars in his bank account, ten thousand in his bank account, a million in his bank account. If you're a dude with integrity, if you're a dude with morals, if you're an upstanding dude, if you're a dude with code, if you're a guy with backbone, if you're a guy that know how to treat a woman without without leading with his pockets, you're going to be that when you got your pockets right. So it's like, I don't understand, bro. Like, bro. I'm telling you, bro, my nephew going to be straight, bro. And my future son, years down the line, he going to be straight, bro. Because it's like, what are y'all doing, bro? <laughs> like, it literally makes me like, it makes me think like, are we, are y'all trolling half the time? Like, I don't understand. I don't understand. I've had girls come see me, bro. And we just talk. Or we just chill. We just hang out. I ain't need to, I ain't need to go all out. I ain't need to do any of that. And I'm not, again, I'm not trying to be on no red pill. I'd be like, oh, I'm not doing this. I'm just saying you don't need to lead with your pockets, bro. If she's a good girl, if she's a girl that deserves it and she's been treating you good and you see good qualities in her, okay, cool. But these are girls y'all first DM. These, these are girls y'all 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 know for a week and y'all like, let me take you shopping. When the last time you took your mama shopping? When the last time you took your sister shopping? When the last time you took your your niece shopping? When the last time you took yo 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 Yo, auntie shopping, bro. And you want to take a chick that you just met on Instagram? You want to take a you want to you want to take a chick shopping that you just met on Instagram? Oh my god, bro. Y'all got it backwards, dog. Like, I can see the dudes that didn't have no father figure. I can see even if even the dudes that got fathers, bro, y'all just so influenced by what the other dude doing. Don't look at these social media influencers, bro. 
Half of these dudes be paying for the cat anyway, bro. It's only a few on the internet that really be doing it. You feel me? I don't want it though. Yeah, feel me? But listen, y'all, like, like, think about that. Y'all don't, y'all take a girl y'all just met on Instagram because she got a fat butt shopping Louis Vuitton, Gucci, go get her something, the fanciest dinner in the city. But when the last time you took your mama shopping? When the last time you took your sister shopping? When the last time you took your auntie shopping? When the last time you spent time with your, 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 your females in your life? But you'll throw your whole paycheck away for a girl, right? Right? So you can get your body count up. So you can go talk to your homies and be like, yo, look, bro, look what I tap. Like, are you are you trying to get the women or are you just trying to impress your homies? You feel me? And it's like, bro, what are we doing? If we start, if 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 we start acting right, the girls gonna act right. Because naturally in a female's mind, they're meant to they're they're meant to follow a man with integrity. But most of y'all dudes don't got no backbone. Most of y'all don't got no integrity. So she's not going to follow you. She's going to walk all over you. But you see, when a dude like me or a dude that know that 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 know himself, when, when they step into her life, when I step into her life, she's going she gonna to be so feminine. She's going to be so nurturing. I'm like, oh, my girl. Hey, man, my girl not nurturing. She's she not feminine. Your girl is a reflection of you. The girls you hang out with, the girls you spend time with, the girls you be smashing is a reflection of you. Feel me? Y'all be just doing the most, bro. Just for some cat, bro. Like, oh man, I got some story times, bro. I ain't even gonna say in this video, bro. But there's been times where it's like, is it even worth it? Does she even deserve it? You feel me? Like, and think about it, bro. Because when we release, we're releasing a life force. We're we're releasing a a that could have been a child. That could have been another human being. We just released that into this woman. And her room is dirty. She got roaches in her room. <laughs> Yo, y'all be blowing me, bro. On my mama, bro. Y'all be blowing me, bro. Like it's it's really getting ridiculous. Um, more of the story, bro. Like the dudes I be seeing that be that be just on on the internet, bro. Like when I step into real life, my homies don't do this. Like all my homies, bro. Like they don't be doing that. But like, dude, like when you go on the internet, you see how many lame dudes is on the internet. You see how many lame dudes really out here and be messing up the game. Y'all be messing up the game. But they be creating these women that be on here talking about some hot girl summer, talking about some I don't need no man, talking about some I need a girl, I need a man to, to spend money on me. Y'all be creating these girls, bro. Y'all creating the monsters. And when you create that monster, bro, it's gonna it's gonna take a while to to, to, to take that take that monster down, man. So more of the story, bro. Have some backbone. Don't leave with your money. Don't leave with your pocket. Leave with your mouthpiece. Leave with you as a person. Lead if you're if like I said earlier, y'all don't know how y'all don't know what to talk about, girl. Y'all don't know what to talk about because y'all boring, bro. Y'all don't know how to talk to women. Your life is boring. You eat hot Cheetos every day, playing video games. Then when you talk to a girl, you don't know what to talk about because you ain't got nothing interesting going on. Then when you get some money, you think you gotta leave with your bread. You know what I'm saying? Now you now you think you gotta cash up her every week to see her. <laughs> Crazy, man. But yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed the video, man. Stay positive, stay safe, stay disciplined, or you will be disciplined. If she ain't getting with the program, she can get the step in. I can go, I can make a whole series about it. I got so much more to talk about, but I'm gonna just cut it short. I love you all. God bless you all. Until next time, until we open the mind once again, the mirror views is out. I love you, man. Peace. You reached the end of the video, bro. Like, thanks, man. <laughs> Hit the subscribe button, you know? Hit the subscribe button, you can. Watch a video on the screen or subscribe. All right, man. Get you can you can leave, you can leave the video now. Leave the video.